Welcome, and follow me as a Samsung Galaxy Flip 7, and today I will show you how you can put this device into recovery mode. So, to get started you will need to grab a cable, plug it into your computer and uh, just have it ready. Next, uh, we're going to turn off our device, so we're going to swipe down from the top of our screen, uh, top right side, and click on the power button and choose power off. Wait for the phone to turn off, and when it does, grab it, you want to hold your power button, volume up, and when you begin holding it, you're just going to plug in the cable. So I am about to be holding, pressing the buttons now, plug it in. Now this might take some time, it might either turn on right away, uh, when you see Galaxy, let go of the power button, uh, FYI. Uh, so right now it happened very quickly, when I tried this just a moment ago before I started recording, it took solid like half a minute to close to a minute for the device to actually start booting up for some reason when I did everything exactly the same. So if the phone is not reacting to the buttons that you're holding, just keep on holding it. Eventually it's supposed to do something. Uh, it's just the question of how long it's going to take Samsung to realize that uh, you're requiring it to do something that it doesn't want to do. Uh, but anyway, uh, when it starts booting up and you see that Galaxy Edition, let go of the power button and it should take you to right here. And now if you do this a different way like rebooting or some other ways uh, without providing for instance your screen lock, the device completely ignores this mode and won't allow you to boot into it. You know, Samsung being Samsung and just removing uh, features from a device because you're not doing it the way they want to, they want you to use your own device. If it sounds absolutely f***ing scammy, uh, that's because it absolutely is, it's your device. You should be able to access this mode in whatever way you want. Anyway, um, while we're in here, uh, you will need to use volume buttons to navigate through the mode or through the options and power button will be used to confirm whatever is selected. Now going over all the options, we have things like reboot system now, which takes us back to Android, just a way of leaving this mode. Then we got apply updates from ADB or SD card, wipe data, wipe cache partition, the Vlux, run tests and uh, power off. So we don't have mount system apparently anymore. Uh, again, feature removed from by Samsung. Uh, cool. So um, in here. I'm going to confirm the reboot system now by pressing the power button and like I mentioned this will bring me back to Android and is a way to leave at this mode. And there we go. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.